Ollie, a very big congratulations. You've had your first squad with the Welsh Senior National Squad. You must be pretty excited. Yeah, massively excited. Um, got the email this morning, just looked at it, it was just kept looking at it. It's pretty surreal. Um, so, yeah, just can't wait. I remember standing not far from you a couple of years ago when you were fresh from Welsh in the 20s, signed your first development contract with the Ospreys. Did you imagine this day would come? Uh, I hoped it would. It was something that I was working towards, but I never thought it would come this quickly. And uh, now it has come. It's, I just can't believe it, really. Um, but yeah, it's one, one of the things I've been working toward, and yeah, I'm just over the moon that I've got there. Is it one of those things that gets talked about in various different ways, but strength in depth and the number of international back rowers there are at the Ospreys doesn't hinder you in terms of development, doesn't stall your progress, it actually gives you more learning, more encouragement and allows you to challenge yourself against the best perhaps. Yeah, it's absolutely massive really this year. We've had Tips, Gingy, we've got Baker, we've got so many good back rowers just just to learn from, you can watch the different games, different styles, and you just try and pick bits off different people, but it's, it definitely helped, helped my development loads this year and the last few years. Def, definitely hasn't you know set it down at all. Of course, in recent weeks, recent months, you had a run of games, you've picked up a few Man of the Match awards, um, shown your destructive self that we're well aware of, but you've also been part of a, a free-running team as well, so you're showing there's many strings to bow, perhaps. Yeah, I think it's probably um, coming off the back of just really good team performances helps me absolutely massively you know when, when we're all going going forward together and you know different players making breaks it makes it easier and it's inevitable that a break's going to come to you eventually so i'm just really grateful to be part of the team that's number, uh, you know top of the top of the table at the moment and next next Monday, you're going to be heading to the Vale and being the new boy in class, waiting for your kit and the handout. It's going to be a bit of a, a different time for you, a different experience. Yeah, it will be. Um, looking at the squad, though, there's a few new boys, so um, yeah, I'm just looking forward to getting there and getting started. So all the seven new boys will be hanging around in the corner, frightened to speak to anybody. <laughs> yeah, probably. I will be. <laughs>